Hey guys, on today's video, we're going to be updating your iPad to the latest iOS. So let's get started. Go right into your settings. In your settings, you're going to see your first option on the top left hand side. It's going to say your Apple ID or maybe your device's name. From there, just go ahead and make a backup. If you have no more space on your iCloud to make that backup, just hook it up to your computer and do that. It's just in case a precaution. Now, your second option might say software update, but for some of you, it may not. So let's just scroll down to general. Under general, our second option will say software update. From software update, we should see the latest thing here. So this is iPadOS 15.0.2. We can just tap on download and install. It might ask you for a passcode if you have one. Now make sure to have at least 50% of your battery. And even if you have 50% of your battery, I would still recommend to hook it up some electricity while you're making any updates. This update's pretty small. It's not going to last that long. So you're not going to have to wait that long. At this point in time, you could just leave your iPad just let it be, it's going to install by itself, or you guys can install it yourselves. Anyways, some of you may have noticed that you don't see the download option. You may only see install. That's okay. Depending on your settings, it may have downloaded the update already. And all you do is have to install it, which, uh, by the way, once you press install, it's just going to restart your iPad. You're going to see an Apple logo, a loading bar, and then you're going to be pretty much done after that. If you want to learn more about the update, you can always click on learn more and then right here it's gonna sum it up for you what it's doing it's just fixing little things but it's definitely things that we need to be fixed anyways let's just click on done once it's done with the downloading it's just gonna take you here where it's gonna just say preparing update and then finally we're gonna get ready to press uninstall now or if you left your ipad to be it's just gonna install it by itself all right so finally once this is done we can just see this install now we're gonna just tap there it's gonna verify the update then it's going to turn off Apple logo, loading bar and we're about to be done. As mentioned, you would see an Apple logo and a loading bar. The first one's going to go pretty slow and this one, the second one's going to go a lot faster and then we're done with the update. And finally, when your update's done, it should tell you this. It's being updated. You can log back into your iPad. Once you log in, you're just going to see everything as normal. We can always double check in your settings, software update and just check that everything went okay. Now it should tell you that you're up to the latest version right here on your iPad OS. Now, if right after the update, anything is glitchy, don't worry about it. Just restart your iPad. You should be fine. But as of now, you should see this, that you're all up to date. Now, if you have an older iPad, not all iPads are compatible with the latest iOS. So make sure your iPad is in the list. I do have a video with a whole list of iPads that are fully compatible with iOS 15 or iPad OS 15. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.